Investigators combing through the rubble of Super Tuesday discover a frightening truth. Tornadoes are getting more powerful. Is there anything we can do to protect ourselves? The first time wind engineer Partha Sarkar from Iowa State University surveyed the wreckage from a tornado, he was determined to do something about it. You may survive a tornado, but your entire life is turned upside down because your whole house is gone, whole neighborhood is gone. And that's what bothers me. If you see the cars which have taken a hit from F5, uh, you see it twisted beyond recognition, you know, people are no match for that kind of wind. On Super Tuesday in Tennessee alone, over 500 homes are destroyed. The cost to rebuild runs into hundreds of millions. Sarkar thinks we can prevent the damage these new, more powerful tornadoes will bring. We can do something about it. We can design these houses to at least not get completely destroyed. If it's partially destroyed, we can rebuild it. If it's completely destroyed and it's gone. In order to figure out how to protect a building, he has to know exactly what the winds are doing inside a powerful tornado. To do that, he has to make himself one. He contacts tornado expert Bill Gallus. It was probably a phone call I'll never forget. Partha wanted to design the first wind tunnel that would create a moving tornado and wanted to discuss what ways might we use to create a moving tornado simulator. This is the result of their collaboration. A twister in a can, 18 feet across and 11 feet high, suspended over a model target. The largest and most realistic tornado simulator ever constructed. It can recreate the same kind of tornadoes that struck on Super Tuesday, from EF1 to the more powerful EF5. It's the only simulator that can accurately measure how the wind loads of a moving tornado affect different kinds of structures. Once they had the large simulator done and had to throw on the power switch, I think there were a lot of people waiting there and scared to death at what would happen. In the past, wind tunnel research simulated only straight line wind. This machine reveals how the circular wind of a tornado can literally pull the roof off a house like a corkscrew. New building design will now incorporate ways to prevent this. <laughs> 